if you are looking to up your audio game then you need a tube preamplifier yes the Pearson tube pre v2 the amplifier as you can see i already taken out the box before i can give you an opinion let's do the unboxing jump to the unboxing table this audio you are hearing directly from zoom f4 jump to the unboxing table and then i'm going to compare the audio yeah jump to the unboxing table What's up guys, it's me Jimmy Agik. So here is the Pearson Tube Pre V2 unboxing. Here we go. So right now let me take out the box. Okay, here it has the manual and then here is the Pearson Pearson uh, Tube Pre V2 and this is the power adapter, nothing special. Okay let me take aside and then open the manual box what inside the manual okay this is a quite good manual as you can see i mean i'm a big fan of pearson to be honest with you pearson is one of my favorite company okay these are the pearson mixer some more information this is quite good man this is quite good pamphlet and here's the manual of the pearson tube pre v2 as as you can see let me show you okay okay yeah so now let me connect it and then demonstrate to you i mean i really like it also it comes with the pearson view label so you can become like their marketing guy i mean a walking billboard for for them i bought a preamp because i think so i need a good quality preamp to give my microphone some warm sound and then yeah here we go and then now let me uh, show you the Pearson view preview to have the box on the back so yeah let me keep the box aside and then now let me bring the Pearson view preview to here we go I mean it's a quite beautiful one you can see here's the drive yeah here's the drive as you can see the drive uh, which will distort your audio signal again if you want to use the preamp you need to use the drive button normally i will start with zero to one hundred percent and then here's the gain i don't i don't think i'm going to gain set the gains high because i'm going to connect this pearson to pre v2 with my zoom f4 which have one of the best preamp already built in but i want a little bit warm sound so here's the view meter for example when the signal is flowing it will show you the view meter when it's clipping it will be going to the red so 80 hz which is for using for the air con fan noise to cut it out phantom power instrument and zero which is like phase invert yeah mostly i will be trying this to only so it use a 12 volt and 1 amp charger in the box you get a universal 240 volt to 120 volt charger which is really a very good thing to be honest with you i will insert my microphone here and out from from here okay yeah that's enough because i don't want to show you my model number at the back yeah that's enough it's a quite beautiful to be honest with you build i mean again it's a quite beautiful piece of hardware so now let me plug in and then now so jump. yeah as i have shown you i mean as i've shown you this look quite good let me put my monitoring headphone on my head yeah here we go here we look much better isn't it no okay i wanna use my i wanna use my panasonic uh, professional headphone for this job yeah i mean panasonic are the best headphone i mean for audio monitoring i really want some good quality audio as you can see okay i didn't plug so right now i am directly the audio you are hearing is from the short super 55 with a pop filter and then directly from zoom f4 as you can see the view meter is not moving now let me do something something i'm going to put i'm going to plug my mic into the pearson uh, pearson uh, two pre v2 okay i'm going to plug my mic as you can see my cable is this one I'm going to plug here and they're going to plug cable back here okay 
let's get started of course the audio is going to be cut to be honest with you the audio is going to be cut let's get started the first thing i need a cable Okay, let me get the red cable from the from the below. Okay, here is the red cable, as you can see. Okay, and then I'm going to stop the audio, but you can hear the video. Okay, there will be some silent. Okay, and then I'm going to put some music. So right now you are hearing we right now you are hearing me from the from the Zoom F4. Okay, so let me sing a song. Uh, something like that it doesn't really matter how hard you try but at the end of the day it doesn't really matter how hard you try oh i mean something another i mean i don't know once upon a time once upon a time there was a jimmy once upon a time there was a jimmy okay let me stop the audio So right now you are hearing me on the two pre two okay I need to make some adjustment definitely eighty okay okay can you hear me can you hear me okay this there's a lot of I don't know some noise is coming for what I really don't understand so I really don't understand why the noise is coming. So I put it drive. Hello. 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 Okay, can you hear me right now? Let me put it a little bit high. Hello. And then let me instrument cut now is better, right? Hello. Yeah, now it's better. Hello. 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 Can you hear me? Hello. Hello, can you hear me? There's a lot of noise coming, I don't understand why. Why is that? I'm not understanding why the noise is coming to be honest with you. Okay, let me figure it out. So right now there is no like I mean his or something like that coming. I don't know why. Let me try it again. To be honest with you, I really don't understand why that is happening. I really don't understand. Okay, let me do it again.
There's some kind of hiss coming, I don't know why. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. I don't still the hiss is coming. Hello, hello, hello. Still the hiss is coming as you can see. Let me take off the phone. Maybe something is like to interfere. You don't understand why the hiss is coming. I don't understand. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. What's up, guys? Now I think there's no his. When I when I put the you hold the button, you can see his happen. Hello, 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 
Hello, what's up guys? It's me Jimmy again. What's what's up guys? It's me Hello. Hello, 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 hello. There's too much hiss is going on. I don't know what is the reason, but there's too much hiss which is happening. I, I don't know. Maybe I can't recommend. I mean, all of my wires are correct. I write double check my wires, but still the hiss is happening. I can't understand the hiss to be honest with you. The hiss is happening quite bad. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. You need to be the judge. How good is the too much is I think I can't recommend subscribe and buy. So right now I already connect my Pearson tube preview to this is my microphone cable going into the Pearson view preview tube I mean as you can see this is my microphone cable and this cable is going to output can you can I show you from the back I mean can you see this is the output going into my zoom f4 let me show you the zoom f4 so yeah here is the zoom f4 as you can see yeah this is the zoom f4 so now I have put the gain a little bit down it's 52 decibel here and uh, because I will be balancing it uh, to make a fair comparison I will just making sure it will only come in zero it do not go about zero so now this is for the zoom f4 and what about the Pearson tube preview 2 yes the Pearson tube preview 2 I'm on the zero drive right now at around how much around like uh, 25 to uh, around 20 I mean around at 20 gain as you can see I'm at around 20 gain again you need to be the judge how good I'm sounding I'm at around 20 gain yeah I mean 20 gain yeah so right now I'm at around 20 gain a zero drive let me test the tube preview tube okay now I'm at 50% now I am at 100% okay I'm going to test it again slowly 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 I'm going to speak something like I mean so I'm a big fan of Pearson View company which is one of the oldest company which builds some really very good audio equipment. I'm a huge fan of it. They build mixer, they build preamp, they build a lot of good stuff. So now I'm going to just do uh, Okay I'm going to sing a song. Uh, uh, for example like Havana Unana Oh ho 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 Havana, oh na na, ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho, my half heart is in Havana, Havana, Havana. Okay, so to use the tube, which is a physical tube inside, it's better I use within like 50%, okay. But there's a little bit background noise, yeah. So, so let me put on the... Oh. <laughs> So what I'm going to do now I'm going to increase the f to 65 gain and I'm going to decrease on the zoom pre person view it uh, on the zoom f4 let me first decrease the gain on the zoom f4 the microphone is going to become silent okay so now I'm on the 65 percent uh, you can see around 60 okay let me just put in uh, 3 o'clock okay and then let me show you the zoom f4 yes the zoom f4 so can you see the zoom f4 yeah here's the zoom f4 now let me show you the zoom f4 
so right now i'm recording on the zoom app for with only uh, plus 70 decibel there's two way first i can lower the gain on zoom f4 and then make the gain higher on the pearson tube pre v2 or i can lower the gain on the pearson pre v tube and then make the gain higher on the zoom f4 so this is the first method uh, recording low on the again i'm clipping a little bit can you see i'm going a little bit about zero so let me make it more below okay 15 so now uh, the the drive is at 50 percent now it's at 100 percent okay now i'm going to use the second method which is like increasing the zoom f4 gain and then making the uh, pearson youtube gain in like middle around like i mean 30 percent so let me increase so lowly so you know tell me which one is better sounding so yeah you need to tell me let me make it like balance okay zero so yeah this is how it is the zero okay again you need to tell me how good i am sounding so now let me so now let me uh, show you something more for example such as uh, such as okay i wanna show you i wanna show you the 80 hertz filter so this is the 80 hertz filter again you need to be the judge can you hear a different or not with the 80 hertz filter okay and this one is the phase uh, like invert i can hear a huge different can you hear or not do you prefer using the phase invert or not now without the phase invert now with the phase invert now with the 80 hertz filter on with the 80 hertz filter off this one instrument you will get no sound so yeah again you need to be the judge i mean i'm personally liking it but do not worry i'm going to replace a tube pre v2 uh, uh, vacuum tube with a better one so again it's going to be a lot of fun now jump back to me so now here is the test of the pearson tube pre v2 pre amp you need to be the judge how good is the audio quality again you need to be the judge i mean to be honest with you to me it's quite good i'm really very much impressed yes remember one thing whenever you're using a physical analog or digital physical physical not plugged in physical preamp or any kind of like equalizer or plug in i mean physical it's going to introduce some noise i don't like software plugins also it do not introduce any kind of noise but it do not sound good i mean you can see it sound awesome and uh, add a compromise of some noise a little bit noise not that much i'm quite happy with it you need to be the judge how good it is if you wanna buy this is a must buy the link is in the description box below if you wanna don't buy still check out the link of amazon i will get a kickback to make such videos so it was me gmail subscribe and bye